Hi there, I'm Tyler and welcome to the channel. Today we are on a mission to hide these hideous green trash cans behind closed doors. All right, so here's the pre-existing condition. I've never been a fan of how these big old ugly green trash cans look. So I'm gonna build a proper hutch around them. This is all gonna be made out of pressure treated two x four and fence boards. I will have plans to this down in the description below if you would be interested in those because these are 96 gallon trash cans and they seem to be a kind of typical size for trash recycling services. This is for two cans. If you have three, I would say you probably wanna build a second hutch because the doors will be so big that I think they will be useless just dragging on the ground. So this is for two cans and let's see what we can do. Right now I'm gonna cut everything for the sides of the structure and the two boards that are gonna hold it together in the back and we'll make sure we're on the right track. Right now you're looking at what will be the top or the bottom of one of the sides. And I want to put the top or the bottom over the exposed edge here so that any water that does make it onto here will drain off the edge instead of puddling up right here. I don't know if this really helps anything, but I've seen exposed ends like this completely rot out in the past. So I'm hoping that that will help protect it a little bit. Gonna go ahead and drill some countersunk holes on the ends here so I don't crack it. Yes, the deck screws usually say you don't need to do it. It's better be safe than sorry. Got a bunch of different brackets left over from the swing set build and I'm going to use some of these guys to attach the horizontal joinery on here so I don't have to have any like pocket holes in the side of these things uh, probably reducing its strength but use these things up. Hold this one and this one. 
What's that? Oh, you noticed the merch? Why, thank you. Yes, I think it's kind of cool as well. Hat on a hat, pretty funny. And we also have some new logos on the shirts as well. You can find out more about this by going to DIYTyler.com slash merch. Link to that down in the description below where you can get some of this fine, very, very comfortable merchandise. Let me get back to finishing this thing up. Much better. Well, there we are folks, all wrapped up, and I gotta say, what a big improvement. Our deck is right over there, and we sit there on a daily basis looking out to the field right over here, and the last thing I wanted to see were those nasty green trash cans. As I've said before, there are plans for them linked down in the description below if you guys would like to build a set to spice up your very own yard. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, please hammer that thumbs up button. Helps us out a ton and gets this video in front of more eyes. I'm DIY Tyler, and you guys have a good one.